What's up guys, it's your boy Gus back in with another video. And today it's gonna be the final like weird video I'll have to say for a bit because I don't wanna keep you doing these weird ones. But today I'm going to be ranking a bunch of Pass Hotel ships. Uh for, I want to say for some of these ones that have on the list, you can lose a character that I don't really know much about. I'm pretty sure that character, uh, I just find this one on the one on the right side of Mr. Velvet. I'm pretty sure that's Angel's sister. I can't remember what she is called. But, anyways, can this might be a short video because with ships, I don't really know what much to say. But, anyways, without further ado, let's begin. First with Charlie and Husk. I'm gonna be honest, I don't I have not seen this one this much. We don't I'm not sure what to feel about it. But I think it's a fine pretty to see. It's weird to ship Charlie with someone who isn't that deep, but sometimes it can work. Now Anna Luke, this is a because this is a lot of really a candid ship, but they are very close in the show. Which makes sense because in and loot is the Adam's top lieutenant, top exterminator right next to him. So, I mean, now I have Cherry Bomb Charlie. I might have say D. I don't think it's just F. I think it's D because they don't barely know each other. For what we, for what we know, they've uh, known each other for a couple of days and maybe a week. You don't really know how much time has passed. But they don't know each other that much. They barely talked. So yeah, that's all I have to say about this one. It's just you don't know how much about how the community is together. Now we have Husk and Angel, or Husk Huskus, or Huskus, if these people call it. This one is this because this feels is good canon that these are gonna be together because it's so close they're so close together and yes they start off with not liking each other but then they start liking each other after an episode which one was i think it's episode four yeah after episode four which was the one involving angel dust and husk after that episode they started to actually be okay with each other more and more which is a good thing and now, and, and yeah, there it is. And I have some pinches and cheer bone. It, it is, it, I like the fact that throughout the actual show, once cheer bone uh, got introduced in the show, that, that it shows us Princess actually does love cherry bone. And through the start of it, cherry bone didn't like the princess at all. He did, she did. But then, when we got to like the last two episodes, she started being a little bit interested about him, which is pretty cool. And well, they end up technically being a canon ship, so I make A as well. Below Adam and Lou, but still an A. Now we have Lucifer and Elizabeth, one of the weirder ones. But okay, this is how I feel about it because I've watched a lot of comic books and one of the things that we got a lot of comics about are these two together and it kind of works weirdly. I don't think it can work as well as other ones but I think it can work B. These two I don't want much to say. We don't know that much about them how they're really business so shit so that's it. That's why I put F. Uh, Alistair and Rosie. Uh, that's her name? No, it's, no Mimsy. Mimsy. Rosie's the daughter one. Mimsy. Uh, this one I have to see. It's a D. A D. I think it's F, but again, we don't really know much about the backstory goes. What all we know is that Alistair was one of her admirers, or he was there for sort of sometimes in her. Area or a business. Answer nifty. I know. 
Nifty might do because again, a lot of Tommy Duffs and Perry, she is a person who likes to draw ships and uh, um, goddamn uh, f uh, fiction and stuff like that. But I don't think they can work together. This is this is a ship, yes, and there is a cannon wood, and this is definitely yes. It makes no sense for this not to be yes because they are together. And yet, after everything they've been through, they are still together and love each other a lot. Madison Husk. This is just a weird one. It's weird because I, I, I'm not going to say D. It can work, but the Husk of the whole ordeal that Elster owns Husk Soul. This shit just feels like it would be a lot about Elster being in control, like literally in control. I don't think that works a lot. I don't like that. And you've seen some pinches. A future, well, most, uh, uh, the most goddamn characters in Hasbro, so are scared of Nifty. So, I'll just put this in F above. He's super, yeah, just in F. Now, this is, it's all the beasts together in a relationship. All of them together in one relationship. If we, uh, what's that called in the relationship terms? I, I completely forgot why that specifically is called. But I don't see, see their good tech business partners all of them together. So a relationship could work, but you don't know much about it. Now, Box and Charity. This is definitely a weird one. Putting them together. Very weird. I have not seen that much of it, so I can't say much. I'll just put them to see because I don't know much about it. Of how it can work. Now, Alistair and, uh, and yeah, Lilith. Again, we don't know much about Lilith and her character, so I'm not sure how this works. I'll just put it at D. Now, we know about Lucifer and Lilith. They were married, or they to be Arsenal married, I believe. But it wasn't a really much of a happy relationship they had together. So, I'll say D. Yeah, I think mean, these crime. Now we have Carmela Carmine and uh, Sophius. We know who they are. Sessual, Sessual, I don't think th these are like good couple, like relationship couple, but they're like good friends. That's why I put it in like a okay, bottom of the. I don't think they can work together that much because they're like a relationship. Yeah. Now, Adam and Lucifer, I know. Adam hates Lucifer with all of his gut. He hates Lucifer. And Lucifer, well, he also hates Adam a lot, but doesn't show it as much. Now, these two don't make anything. I don't know. She should have not even met. I don't think that can work. This one is weird. Yes, they've shown to be get along well when, when Charlie got into heaven and met her for the first time. So, and for that, I think they can work if it comes to a point where so a really thing happens between Charlie and Maggie, where it, I don't think it will. That's the thing. I think it's up to see. Might work. This one, though, is a nope. I don't feel like Vox and Angelos could be a great couple. I don't feel like they're, they mix well together. Now, Charlie and Velvet. I'm not sure. I'll just put this in a D right there. I don't know how this will work that well. I don't think it will. This one. Mm, maybe. It's like a maybe, like C. Could work, but I don't think it could work that well. And now we have Valentino and Alistair. Two of my favorites. But I don't think they can work well together. Maybe. It's just a maybe. Very low chance, but it could work. This one I don't think so. Because these are really, it's saying they're really old and creepy together. They've been knowing each other for a while. I don't think that can work well together. 
Now we have Becky and Cherry Bomb. D. Okay, now I'm only gonna put these in F, mainly because I don't know that much about this character. That's the only reason that he's going in F. Oh wait, that's something different. And then there's a uh, Velvet and Becky. And you see what's going on. Velvet and Becky, I think this. Hmm. D, the board bottom side. You're going there, and you. Now, Charlie Alistair, I've seen some comic work, and kind of work. So, I'll put it in B. This could work. Work well. This, I don't think. Most relationship face with the Queen's Fellows, you know, I don't think it worked that well. Unless it's so as chaotic as evil as him. That's why this is going at F as well. I was gonna, and what was he? I don't feel like this could work. Because for what is seen to show, Rosie seems like it's more like a moderately type figure, but a big, big sister type thing with Alistair. They're really close. I don't think that close. <laughs> Bottom of D could, but I don't think it would. Could. Oh. Well, then, Alistair, I don't think this could work at all. Might have a small chance of working. That's it. Angel and Alistair, I've seen it, okay again, this is going off my experience of watching a lot of comic dubs. And what I've seen, people have made so these two get along very well. I think it's A, a top of A. You might be a man of me, but I did read, read or watch a bunch of Hasbro's so com like fan comics. Some of the comic dubs were different, the shit ones. They can work well with some characters like Alistair and Angel. Angel's Apprentice, we don't think that could work well. Bottom of the maybe could work. This one, it works well. Because they've it, been kind of shown that they are in love for each other and are in wish. But of course, that's, you know, being like, like an overlord of lust. A moth demon or a little less, I don't think he likes to show it. Lux and Alistair, put it B, because it could work, because we don't know what the relationship was before the seven years. Uh, Nifty and Husker, uh, no. Angel and Valentino, I don't know, I, this is just, wait. I don't, Angel was, most people felt you know, all this is somewhat as chaotic as him, like this. I don't think it can work most of the time. One of the small chances it could work, very small chance, but not really. Now, these three together, I've seen a bit of comics where plot uh, saying that these three together, like it's a one, but I want to see. And these three. Bottom of C as well. And yeah, I feel that is it. Again, if we're missing some ships, that's because this list I found, but this person does exist all has hotel ships. So maybe some characters have not been shipped together for some reason. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. The next video will probably be a head of us fan songs to this and then I'll probably after that one do a head song tell one but anyway for that if there's some specific head of us fan songs you want me to cover in that let me know in the comments down below because I'm going to search for head of us fan songs see what I can find that aren't just my own listen to that I have just listened to my own because I want to see if I can find someone um, I haven't listened to before. Anyway, I thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. You can be always unsubscribe later if you don't enjoy my content. You enjoy enjoying me as a person. That is completely fine. <laughs> and remember, you matter in this world. There's always someone who will love and care about you. And no matter what you're going through, no matter how hard it is, 
You're very sweet. You're about taking your life and don't do it. There's someone who loves and cares about you. And if you don't think so, join the community. I love and care about every single one of you. Be happy, stay happy, and show your love to people next time. Bye.